Simon Leviev, who is the focus of Netflix movie Tender Swindler, has been banned from the dating app and others, following allegations he scammed women out of thousands. Leviev is also banned from dating sites including as Match.com, OkCupid and Hinge, all owned by parent company Match Group Inc. In an email, Tinder confirmed to USA Today that Leviev and any of his known aliases are no longer active on the account. Leviev was banned from Tinder in 2019 and attempted to create an account again in 2021, according to Tinder. The Tinder swindler and why we can't look away from these horror stories of deception. Netflix exposes the Tinder swindler. The documentary, which was released February 2, alleged that Leviev would match with women, tell them he was son of a billionaire and take them on luxury trips around Europe. He would later trick the women into believing he was in trouble and needed money, and then never repaid them. Pernilis Yoholm who befriended Leviev and was featured in the show, said she was relieved he was banned from the app. These fraudsters and scammers are a serious threat, Sio Holm told The Wall Street Journal, adding she was happy to have been a part of shedding light on this issue. Sign up for our trending newsletter to get the latest news. Just before the documentary was released, Tinder published tips on how to spot scammers and advised people to never send money to people who avoid meeting in person. Romance scammers prey on individuals who are already making themselves vulnerable in looking for love and can be hard to spot, the fact sheet included. Follow Gabriella Miranda on Twitter, at it's Gabby Miranda.